Hi, I'm Brian Petrie of Tech Stocks Rock. One of the first social media stocks, LinkedIn, had an outrageous IPO, doubling its $4 billion initial valuation to $9 billion. Facebook is being valued greater than $50 billion, and some estimates have Twitter valued at $10 billion. Are we beginning to see signs of irrational exuberance? It's not a tech stock bubble, but potentially a social media bubble. Could this be greed and madness of the crowd? A place where exaggerated expectations and the fear of missing out on first mover opportunities prevails? Are we overestimating the potential of new technologies that connect people? The true test will be if social media can increase their customer base and monetize their revenue streams simultaneously. Blasting social media users with banner ads really isn't the effective way for most companies to advertise on those sites. Real social media advertising is supposed to get people to refer their friends to a company's product or service. Not always the easiest thing to do. Early tests of ads on Twitter are not working out so well. Twitter has experienced tremendous traffic growth, but now struggles to scale advertising revenue. Twitter recently purchased TweetDeck for $40 million in a cash and stock deal. Some speculate this was to improve their ability to present advertising more effectively. Zynga wants to file for an IPO in the next month or so. Facebook is expecting a $100 billion valuation by IPO in 2012. However, I'm not going to get caught up in the fear of missing out. The prophecy of the rapture proved to be a bust. Could social networking become the next big bust? I believe the probability is so great that in the short term, I'm going to steer clear of social media stocks and see if they can deliver first. To gain an investment edge, visit our website at techstocksrock.com and sign up for our newsletter about hot trends driving tech stocks.